Hi guys, welcome back. It's me, Tasha E. And today I kind of want to make today's video like a freestyle video, like an all natural. Like I have on no makeup, my hair is in a messy bun, and I just want to talk about whatever kind of pops in my mind. So we're gonna call it Freestyle Thursday with Tasha E. So let's see what I want to talk about. Have you ever prayed to God for a sign to help you make a choice about something or help you make a decision about a situation or maybe a job or whatever? And you just pray for God to send you a sign and then you go to thinking about it and then you get scared about what the answer going to be like. If the sign that you pray for is going to actually happen or what if it don't happen? And like, I just, I, I be wanting to pray for signs about different things, but I just be terrified of the answer. Even though I know the answer is going to help me in the end because I won't have to really worry about whatever I'm trying to figure out or what decision I'm trying to make because once I get the answer, it's pretty much solved. But like some things, I just be scared. I be really scared to see what the answer gonna be because some of these things, I be wanting the answer to be yes. But then you might not get the sign or he might not send the sign that you want so the answer might be no. And I just be like, I mean, really terrified of the answer. And I know I probably shouldn't be because it's just worse off for me wondering when I could just pray to God and ask him to send me a sign to let me know, hey, is this what I need to do or is this not what I need to do? But yeah, I just, like now I'm dealing with this situation that I really want God to send me a sign, but I am so terrified of what the answer could be. I just don't know, and I, I just don't know what it could possibly be, but I just feel like it probably won't be what I want it to be. But I pro it'll probably hurt me for a little while, but then in the long run, it'll, it'll be for my good. But I don't know. I just be scared, y'all. And then I'll be trying, I'll be wanting to like, I don't want to say challenge God, but I be wanting to like really see his powers. Like, you know how in the back in the Bible days when he turned water into wine and when he let the staff turn into a snake and, you know, all this stuff. I be wanting to like see his power, like for real. Like, I know, I know God is powerful and he can do anything, but like, I be wanting to see it. Like, and I know it's probably going to scare the mess. <laughs> out of me but i be really wanting to like see it like really see it like one night i was in my room and i was getting ready for bed and i think i was pulling my shirt off or whatever and i was like god just show me your power just let the shirt shoot off my arms and then right quick behind it i was like never mind no 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 don't do that don't do it because I'll probably go into cardiac arrest if that shirt would have flew off my arms. Like, <laughs> I literally probably would have fainted, really. Even though I asked him to do it, the fact that it really happened and that he is God and he could have really done it scared me. So I changed my mind. I said, mm -mm, never mind. Never mind, God. That's all right. I'm good. <laughs> I still believe you. I still trust you. But yeah, but like back to the signs, like for this situation that I'm, I'm dealing with and that I really want to answer to, like when I pray for that sign, like I want it to be something out of the ordinary. Like I don't want it to be something that could happen and I could come up with some reason why it happened and not that this was my sign. Like I'm the type of person, I really need the sign to be like, out the ordinary like me riding down the road and like it's on a big old billboard and say Tasha this is your sign 
from God. <laughs> like, this is God talking to you, Tasha. This is your sign. Like, I need something that's gonna, like, literally blow my mind so there's no way I can say it was something I thought of or something that happened coincidentally or something that was gonna happen. It's got to be something that is completely out of the ordinary that my mind couldn't even begin to understand what just happened. Like, it's got to be so, like, crazy because anything else, like, I don't even know what to pray, what kind of sign to pray for. Like, do you guys pray and ask God to see your sign about different things? Because I be wanting to, but like I said before, I be scared of the answer. And then the little things I be coming up with to show a sign is like things that could happen on the daily. So it would just be me to pray for something like, Lord, while I'm at work, let a person come in here with a red shirt on. Okay, the day going by. Mm hmm day going by. A man or a woman come in with a red shirt on. I'm like, oh my God. This is my sign. This is my sign. 15 minutes later, two or three or more people come in with a red shirt on. Like, I would be like, no, God, I'm confused. Like, was that my sign or was that not my sign? See, I need something that can't happen like that. Like, I need something that's going to be out of the ordinary. So that I will know that I know that I know that that was a sign from God. And I just don't know what that sign could be that I could think of to ask God to help me to, or not to help me, but for him to let me know about this situation. Like, I don't know what kind of sign. I don't know, but I'm gonna figure it out because I really want God to give me a sign about this situation because I really need to move past this situation in my life. I really do. And I really want to. Even though I don't know what the answer might be and it might not be what I want to hear. But I gotta do it. I gotta do it. But yeah. I'm just I got to pray about these these signs because I'll just be terrified. I'm so terrified of what the answer is gonna be. Even though I know that God has every good intention for my life like but I just and I know the answer he gives me is going to be the best answer for me even though it might not be the answer I want to hear or it might not be the answer that's going to make me feel happy at the moment but <sighs> I got to get that answer only way this is going to be able to completely move my life. Give me my closure. I need him to send me a sign. I gotta come. I gotta pray. Well, what kind of sign? Because like I said, it got to be out of the ordinary. It got to be something just like I don't know. I don't know, but anyway, yes, so that was just my kind of freestyle for today about praying to God for signs and not being scared to see what the answer is going to be. So yeah, you guys, that was a quick little freestyle for y'all today, just something off the top of my head that, you know, I've been thinking about this week and I just wanted to share it with you guys because you might be Deal with the same thing. You might have a situation and need to pray to God for a sign to help you make the right choice or decision. And you might be scared of what the answer may be, like me. But I'm going to pray that God give me strength to be able to receive whatever answer he gives me. Because I know in the end it's going to be the right choice for me and the right answer for me. And it can only work for my good. So yes, you guys, I hope y'all enjoyed this freestyle today. Um, I'm sure I have more freestyle videos to come so subscribe to my channel like leave a comment share and i will talk to y'all soon i'm tasha e bye